Okay, here we go. There's the Jaguar XJ we have in our showroom. Um, it's actually been parked in the same spot for probably two weeks without being moved. So I thought I'd do a cold start on it so folks can know that it doesn't sound like a rattle box or anything bad when it cold starts. Uh, I've got both keys for it. I'm going to hop in it right now. And I'm going to stick the phone outside the car so you folks can hear it better. Okay, some other folks just walked in the building, so I have to help them, but then I'll continue this video. Okay, I've got it pulled out so we can do a proper walk around on it. Um, let's start off at the front here. Um, it's actually pretty darn chip free in the front. Um, looks like there's this little guy, that one, that one. Um, that's just some fuzz, that little chip right there. The hood is a uh, great shape. Uh, both the headlights are nice and clear. Um, let's see, and then we'll continue on this way. We'll stop at this wheel here. Um, there's some real minor stuff, a little bit of curb wrench there. Uh, tires are from uh, last year, so they're certainly not old, and they're uh, Continentals, Extreme Contact. That's nice. Um, this is just dirt on the side here from when it was driven in the rain. Um, same with the rest of that. Then coming back over here, here's the other wheel. Uh, same tires, so they matching. Um, this is also just dirt from being driven in the rain. Um, and you can see if we kind of go down the profile of the car, there's no dings or dents and the paint is uniform. Um, then let's come back here. Let's see here. Yeah, it's really in good shape. Same thing here again with the dirt from um, this wheel is in great shape as well. Keep on going around. Same, more dirt from just being moved around in the rain. And then if we go down the side, look at the profile of the car, you can see there's no dents really or things or anything like that. And then we'll look at this wheel, which is also in great shape. Oh, it's got that, it's got this little bit right here. This is dirt. Um, it's got that little scuff right there. It's got that scuff right there. All right, moving on to the interior. Let's start with what everyone wants to see, which is the driver's seat. Um, you know, there's your normal, you know, minor, you know, little kind of cracking and whatnot that, you know, but like nothing bad. Um, really, the seat's in good shape. Um, there's a few little marks right there in the leather on the driver door. Uh, let's see. Steering wheel. None of those switches have been ruined by some woman with long nails. Um, they're all in good shape. Here's your cup holders working properly. Here's that. That's nice and clean. Actually, it's not as clean as it could be, but you know, it's good. Um, love box. Okay, picking up where we left off, uh, we'll do the, we'll, we'll show you the seat features first. So front seats can be heated or cooled. There we go. Then you can also choose if you want just the back or the base as well on that. Then you've got, oh, I wanna turn it off, there we go. Then you've got your massage functions. So you can choose the program it looks like. Oh yeah, there we go. Anyhow, go back from there. Oh, no, oh, didn't mean to do that. Let's go back to the seat function. Okay, I'm gonna turn that off actually. Um, then the rear seats, they have heating and cooling as well, no massage though. Uh, this does have the blind spot monitor. That little amber dot in the top left of the cor top left corner just lets you know that it's active. Um, gosh, it's got a heated steering. Oh, some so the sun is messing with the lens right now. It's got a uh, heated steering wheel. That's what that switch is for. 
Uh, it's got the Meridian sound system, which sounds amazing. Uh, you've got the power rear sunshade there. Then you've got the pano roof. And I think if I press, yep, there we go. And then this opens as well. Just the, the rear glass doesn't open, but the front one does. That's how much it opens. There we go. Okay. Let's see what else I can show. The rear seats are, are really in excellent shape as in most cars, as long as children weren't in them. And then here, I'll show you the switches for the back here. They've got their own climate control back there and those are the adjustments for their heat, uh, for their seating. Another cool feature back here is uh, once the window's already rolled up, if you pull up on the power window switch again, it rolls up this window shade. Pretty nifty. Uh, same thing for that side. Right, let's make sure it works, shall we? Yep, sure does. Okay, let's open up the trunk. It's got the factory floor mats. This, oh here, that's the driver one, and it's in great shape. That's the front passenger. These are both the rears. And here, let's go look underneath here. There's your spare. There's in that little plastic there, that's the key for the locking lug nuts. There's the battery that was put in September of last year. And then I know that we just replaced that little auxiliary battery and it was not cheap. Um, and then shuts just like it should. 